Rolls-Royce delivered the first batch of its MTU-8V199 power packs to General Dynamics for U.S. Army's M10 Booker Armored Fighting Vehicle Program, marking a significant step for Rolls-Royce's power systems business. It's the first time an MTU serial production engine has been used in a U.S. Army land defense program in over four decades. During the low-rate initial production phase, LRIP, Rolls-Royce is set to provide up to 96 power packs, with the potential for additional units as the program moves into serial production. The Series 199 power packs will be assembled and tested at the MTU manufacturing facility in Aiken, South Carolina. The LRIP phase for the M10 Booker program is expected to continue through 2025, with serial production planned for 2026, pending LRIP evaluations. Scott Hansen, Director of Defense for Rolls-Royce Solutions America, commented on this development, noting its importance for the potential partnership with General Dynamics. The MTU Series 199 engine is known for its high power-to-weight ratio and features six and eight-cylinder engines. The power pack is an integrated system that combines the engine, transmission, cooling system, air filtration, energy system, preheating equipment, power management, and vehicle integrated features. Its compact and flexible design allows for customization to suit various vehicles and mission profiles. To meet increasing customer demand, Rolls-Royce is currently working on increasing the power output of the previous top model of the MTU Series 199, the 8V199 TE23, which will provide 800 kilowatts of power, catering to the off-road mobility needs of heavier vehicles. This development is set to enhance the capabilities of the MTU Series 199, which is already in use in more than 2,500 light armored vehicles across several armed forces, including the Austrian Ulan, British Ajax, European Boxer, Spanish Pizarro, Singaporean Hunter, Polish Borsuk armored vehicles, in addition to the American M10 Booker MPF. The M10 Booker, previously known as the Mobile Protective Firepower, MPF, is a tracked combat vehicle developed by General Dynamics Land Systems for the U.S. Army's Infantry Brigade Combat Team, IBCT. The vehicle was designed to enhance the combat capabilities of the IBCT, a highly mobile and flexible unit in the U.S. Army. The M10 Booker is equipped with a 105mm cannon, a 7.62mm coaxial machine gun, and a 12.7mm machine gun, offering versatility in various combat situations. The vehicle's design incorporates features from the M1 Abrams tank, providing a modern fire control system and additional armor for crew protection. It is powered by an 800 horsepower MTU 8V199 power packs diesel engine, enabling a maximum road speed of 65 km per hour and a road range of 305 km. The M10 Booker features a 105mm cannon capable of firing APDS, armor-piercing discarding sabo, and he, high explosive, rounds with notable ranges. The vehicle's design follows a conventional layout, with the driver and engine located at the front and the turret at the rear, accommodating a crew of three, including a commander, gunner, and loader. It includes additional armor panels and protection against improvised explosive devices, IEDs, for crew safety. The vehicle's mobility is provided by a potent MTU diesel engine and hydropneumatic suspension, allowing it to operate in various terrains, including steep hills, valleys, and urban environments. The M10 Booker is equipped with Saffron Optics 1's Paseo Commander's Independent Tactical Viewer, CITV, for improved situational awareness and targeting capabilities. With its combination of firepower, protection, and mobility, the M10 Booker is a notable addition to the U.S. Army's armored vehicle fleet. In June 2023, the U.S. Army awarded a substantial contract to General Dynamics for the production and fielding of up to 96 M10 Booker vehicles. The U.S. Army acquisition objective, AAO, for the MPF is 504 vehicles, with 14 MPFs per infantry brigade combat team. The targeted fielding for the first unit equipped in fiscal year, FY, 2025.